How's it going, everybody? Cruz here with some more Pokemon Legends Arceus or Arceus. <laughs> um, I don't think we have much to report here. We're not going to be able to level up just yet. Um, but I did notice on my map there is a butt ton of new requests. Um, are they upstairs or downstairs? Let's take a look. It looks like they're around the building. I don't know if there's any down here. It looks like they're all outside of the building. Um, and that's fine. Normally, you could see them from, like, here if they were in here. So I guess they're all outside. Let's go take a look. Um, we may be heading into a new zone soon, which could be interesting. Um, it says Battle Adam. Okay, and he's got a leafy on. Um, leafy on. Let's go ahead and there we go. That ought to do the trick. Um, do you, can you evolve yet? Nope. I saw I had more quests, but where are they? Let me talk to the people out here first, and then we'll talk to Adam and battle Adam. What are you guys selling? I'm actually so poor, dude. Oh, Pokeball set. What is a mechanical tub? Whoa, I cannot afford that. Pokeball. Oh, 1500. Let's do it. Oh, no, I don't have enough money. <laughs> I don't have enough money for it. I was like, let's do it. I actually, I do have some powder in here, and I think I have a nugget in my inventory somewhere that we could sell. Let's try to sell that stuff and get some of our money back, man. What happened, guys? Guys, what happened? Why am I so poor now? Uh, where are the... Uh, that is... Um, hold on. I know I put some things in here that could be sold. Unless they're in my inventory. Pretty sure I put some dust in here. Um, oh, here we go, Stardust. There we go. There we go. Sold at a high price. A star piece. Blue shard we need for a quest. A rare seed. To have a Pokemon learn rare. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the good stuff. Okay, we should be able to get some of our money back here. Oh, I need to transfer items, dude. Get rid of the hopo berries. Get rid of that. A nugget. Oh yeah, we not. We need that. Get rid of those beans. Mud ball. Get rid of that seed for now. I think we are mostly good here. These are all items that I kind of need. I'm gonna sell a good bit. That way we can kind of make some of our money back. I am quite poor. And I think I can sell to Volo. Wait, this is not Volo. Um, this is Tui. Okay. Okay. Oh, my lord. Guys. Whew, we just got all our money back. Plus more. Pokeball set. I want to see that. What is it? What is it? 30 Pokeball. Okay, that was worth the money, dude. What is a mechanical cabinet in a tub? I'll get it just because I don't know what it, what it does. You can solve this item's mystery. It will surely be greater than the price you paid for. Well, uh, well then, I'll get the sent to your quarters free of charge, of course. What What is this stuff? What, what do you do with these mechanical items? 40,000? Oh Lord, let's uh, let's stop that. Um, so it's being sent to my quarters. What do I do with? I just kind of purchased it out of curiosity. I don't really know what it does. Okay, I'll go ahead and organize. Where is um? Wait a second. Did I buy that cabinet and it's now in here? Is this it? Oh. Oh, fr we bought a fridge. We can design our house, guys. Oh, we just bought a fridge. I thought I bought a cabinet. Oh, boy. 
Okay. Well, that's cool. That was the first thing that popped up. Man, now I kind of want the other item, the tub. Because we'll have to get that next time. So let's go ahead and accept these quests here. If I may, would it please you if I expanded the variety of clothes I carry? To seek new clothing is the true calling of any fashion conscious person after all. But I need some inspiration to come up with new designs. I'd like to see the Pokemon Worma down. Okay, I think I have I have several of those. About your request. Are you gonna show me a Wormadon? Yes, I will. I've got like three of these. So this is what is known as a trash cloak. Oh. It's loving proof that there's a truth to the saying, one person trash is, a, is another's treasure. I never knew Pokemon were capable of such things. I got it. I'll be pleased if you have a look at the latest additions to my clothing. Cool, that was simple enough. You know, I have several different worms. I wonder if she would have liked to... Um, if she have, would have wanted these other ones that I have. Like, if would, have that, would that have affected the items in the store? I don't know. Okay, these look like old stuff. Well, I guess what's going to be new is the colors, essentially, huh? I really wish it was... Um, I really wish they made it simple to know what was new in here, because I actually don't remember. Okay, flame, blank, sky, insects. Some of, I'm pretty sure a lot of these were here already. Okay. Maybe camouflage. Was that it? Maybe camouflage. Um, I don't know. We're, we're done shopping. I'm not really interested in what she's got there. We just bought uh, items and outfit last time. Oh, it's my most valued cu customer. I was just hoping you'd come by. Yes, it's the same business all over again. Tao Hua just refuses to sim supply any new goods to me. I suppose you must be wondering why he refuses any time I deal with him directly. Well, let's just say he has his reasons. Please speak to him for me. Okay, crunchy salt. So we need crunchy salt. Probably going to be from a new region. We need three crunchy salt. Most likely from a new region we're going to. So there's a quest here, and then one at the farm, and then we can continue on with our lives here. What am I going to do at this rate? I'll make a real fool of myself in front of Conlon. Hello, you're one of the kids from the Survey Corps. Huh. You might actually be the person I need to help me out with a little research. My boy Conlon and I are planning to head to Prelude Beach at night to try and find the ghosts that are rumored to haunt the place. But ghosts scare the daylights out of me. I mean, uh, my son. Yeah, he's terrified. <laughs> You'd think we could just not go and call it a day, but no, I'm afraid his little heart's set on it. But you know, I feel I can't stay scared of ghosts forever, right? It's just too tragic. For my boy, I mean. So maybe if I study up on ghosts, I can find a way to help my boy conquer his fears. If you've got any research data on spooky Pokemon, Ghastly would be a good one. I'd be grateful if you share it with me. Okay, I don't know if my Ghastly is... It's not level 10 yet. Clearly, because he'd have taken my quest. Ghastly, where you be, Ghastly? Okay... I've definitely captured a ghastly. I passed it? I had to have, because there's no way. Am I blind, dude? It's Where are you, ghastly? Oh my god, guys. I don't know. Oh, we're looking at Cobalt Islands, dude. Oh, man. So clearly there's no Gastly's in Cobalt Island. <laughs> um, but wow, I'm like, okay, Gastly's level 5. I guess we'll have to find more Gastly's and work on that quest. Let's go import to the farm. And accept that quest. They probably want another Pokemon. 
Yep. How are the crops doing? I think we collected them last episode. Yeah, we did. What do you need now, buddy? He wants to make the fields bigger. There's boulders sitting right in the way. Lend us a Pokemon I can smash things to pieces. Cool. Yeah, I can do that for you. I can give you a Pokemon right now. Rock smash. Nice. You want a Rhyhorn? Um, hold on, hold on. I am not giving you one of a good nature. Jolly. Oh my god, guys. We have a Jolly Rhyhorn. Holy crap. Mod oh, I was like, a modest Rhyhorn? You can have it. Um... have this one the serious Rhyhorn take that one yeah you can have that little Rhyhorn it'll make a big help in expanding the fields might as well get started your Pokemon pulverized those boulders like they were yesterday's gravel now I'm pumped up sit back Miller is gonna make the fields bigger than ever And I'm all done. Congratulations. I don't see this field getting any larger than this. We'll keep your Pokemon here to help out with the field work a little longer. Give a holler if you want to swap. Okay. No problem. A quest 60. We're looking good. I do not see this field getting larger than this. The only way I see this improving is if, like, um, maybe the crops come faster. Or uh, maybe they increase the number of the crops, you know? So let's go ahead, guys, and let's battle Adam. We've got our Arcanine prepared. I'm ready for you. Go around with me, you bet. Melly, make sure you watch closely. Okay, Avery. You can't fool me, Avery. I know it's you. I know it's you. Oh, look at that little Eevee. Get out of here. <laughs> Let's just do a regular Raging Fire. Ooh, get crushed. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I should capture you. Is this his quick attack? <laughs> You're adorable. Baby doll eyes. Okay. Okay. Oh, there is no capturing. Okay, you're... Alright, you're lucky, little buddy. Let's do a fast uh, rock slide here. Might finish it, actually. Oh, wow, man. Oh, it's just a regular crunch here. Bro, you're battling the Lord. The Lord of the Volcano. You're battling Lord Growly. You see how good he is now? No more sneering at him. Heh. Now, I think our helper from the Pearl Clan was going to meet you at the training grounds once you're ready. Till later. Glad to have your help as always. Melly is a bad guy. Shift yourself unless you want to get even more of an earful than you're already due for. Come on, Adam. Cut me some slack here. Celine. Uh-oh. Join me in the core office. We'll go over particulars of our new mission. Okay. Your survey work will take you to the Cornet Highlands next. You'll be on the Rift's doorstep. There's no telling what perils await. Your current rank qualifies you to conduct research in Cornet Highlands, but you'll need help from a particular person to survey and ultimately quell this electrode. Go to the training grounds. You should find them there. Okay. Did uh, Adam heal my Pokemon? 
Oh no. Well, we're full health, so I'm gonna assume that we are healed. Okay, training grounds is over here. Hello. This gentleman is Warden Ingo. He serves... He serves Sneasler. He will guide you to her domain. Man, this guy reminds me of one of the Elite Four, the Dragon Trainer. God, I can't think of his name. He was like... Ah, oh, he had such a cool theme, too. I think it was the game where Salamence was, in, was uh, introduced. Huh, I can't recall right now. Pleased to properly meet you. I apologize for the, that abrupt how do you do before. I'm the Warden Ingo. I understand you need a hand from Sneasler in order to meet Electrode. Whether she'll see fit to help you, however, we can only find out by making the journey. Now let's have a safe journey to Mount Coronet. All aboard! Ingo's a bit like you, you know. Like me. He appeared one day from who knows where. What's more, much of his memory seems to be missing. Maybe traveling with you will help fill in some of those gaps. In any case, I'm glad to have your help to count on once again. Good luck in the Highlands. Well, do we have enough Pokeballs? We could use more Ultra Balls. Um, everything seems to be okay, though. I think we're fine for the most part. Let's do it. Let's do it. Ooh, it's in the middle. I would like to find a Pokemon to, re to replace Ozon Ghoul. Maybe a new Hisui Pokemon could be cool. What is this we're running into? There you are, my boy. Welcome to the Corned Highlands. I expect you'll find all sorts of rock-type and ground-type Pokemon wandering around these craggy, boulder-strewn heights. And up there, right beneath that great rift, is the peak of Mount Cornet itself. The magnetism from it may well exert some sort of influence on the Pokemon throughout the area. Fascinating stuff. Make your way up the mountain with Ingo. Well, first things first, what's out here? Oh, I need to loot items. That is not an item. I kind of just want to see what's out here. Let's do a little exploring first before we get crazy. Defeat these things. I think I saw a Yan Mega. Wow, he caught on. I'll spell a uh, Luxio there. Luxio there. Weird. Pretty sure I saw a, um. Not a Yanma, but a Yan Mega. Yan Mega! I would love a Yan Mega. I truth be told I've never actually built one up. Oh wow. I think Mud Bomb would be better because it's special. Graveler has no special special beefiness. Only physical. Dude, that is a Yan Mega if I ever saw one. Wow, 
we caught the Yon Mega. Dang it, I hate this. I can't believe we caught the Yon Mega, guys. Pretty awesome. Get some trees, here's some wood. There might be a different color Wormadon in this area. Oh yeah, I can swim now. What am I scared of, dude? I can totally jump down there. Really cool, we found a Yanmega already. Very awesome. Let's see if it's a different color Wormadon. Is this, do I have this one? I think I have all the colors already, don't I? Hmm. I think I have all the colors already. We don't need that. Oh no, it wasn't a worm. That's a Burmy, dude. What am I thinking? Um. Well, let's continue. Actually, I want to go the other direction too. What is that? Oh, that statue. I was like, man, what is this? Is this a Pokemon? Such a Pokemon, but who could have made it and how long ago? Okay, you can't destroy it. Ooh, look. A wig. Uh. Such a Pokemon, who could have made it and how long ago? It's a Clefable. It's crazy. Baby Parasex, a big Parasex. Yanmega is not hard to capture, guys. Plump beans. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, explore where they want us to. Now, the question is... If I go up to the Yanmega... Will it challenge me? Aww. All right, well, that's fine. To be fair, we did capture two. Unseen, we'll just continue. Hardy Grains. Hello, Yanma. I just want to see what's over here, that's all. Okay, well, let's continue inside. Just in case it's an automatic video clip. I don't want to risk it. Yep. The electrode known as the Lord of the Hollow is somewhat different from the electrode I recall, but its electrical discharges at least are familiar. One false step around it could put you in danger. If you're gonna face it, you might consider catching Pokemon that can withstand electricity. It must be difficult, but a Pokemon, don't you think? It must be difficult being a Pokemon, don't you think? Especially one as irritable as Electrode, then becoming frenzied to boot. So true, it's a tough old life for Pokemon and humans alike. Who is this? Oh my god, Avery. Well, well, Warden Ingo of the Pearl Clan. Oh. Oh my, the galaxy grunt from before. You're punching well above your weight to seek out the great Electrode, Lord of the Hollow. But by the sheer tenderness of, uh, tenderness of my heart, I'll grant you a trial to see if you're worthy. The greatest obstacle you ever face awaits you right here. Battle me if you dare. Absolutely not. Oh man, I thought that was the first. Well then, let me tell you the great Melly's take on this whole situation. The frenzy of our nobles is nothing other than a mark of Almighty Sano's favor and protection. Why? Because it makes them stronger. Do I really need to spell that out? That's a good thing. 
We must let my lord frenzy as it may to demonstrate to Almighty Sano that the Diamond Clan lives as is right as good. This may even be, dare I say, the very reason I'm here on this earth. Oh my god, you are such an Avery. What business is it of the Galaxy team anyway? If Electro lets loose a few sparks out here in the mountains. Really? You should do us all a favor and slink back home to that village rather than persist in his folly. And what that? Bon voyage. What a selfish outlook. These frenzies cause the Pokemon themselves such suffering. But what else do you want to do? What is it that you want to do? Press on. Very well. The tracks ahead will be perilous, but I pride myself on safe driving. To meet Sneasler, you must pass through here, Wayward Cave. Here you'll find Pokemon like Golbat and their ilk, which are quite at home navigating in the dark. It's quite dim inside, so you'll need to watch your step. Okay. Alright, um... Who is going to perform very well against everything? Maybe Ragu. Ragu's got us covered for rock types and uh, maybe not so much Golbats, but this is odd. The torches that lit the way through the cave are gone. This could be Meli attempting to obstruct us. Either way, there's no need for concern. I know my route and I'll conduct us safely. No darkness nor foul weather will delay us. Onward we roll. Take, uh, take care. Okay, uh... He's going right, um, okay, can I open my map in here? No. Please don't fall behind, we must keep on schedule. So he went right, and then right, that looks like a dead end. Please forgive the unscheduled stop. I detect an alpha crowbat to our right. Under normal circumstances, I doubt its presence would obstruct someone so competent as you. But given the poor visibility, I propose a track change in the interest of safety. Please follow me. Okay. I'm starting to recall a man who looked like me. We'd battle and discuss Pokemon. Dude! He's the... Is he uh, the ancestor of the dragon trainer? The guy, he used to be like a pirate too. Like he used to dress like this too. God, I can't think of his name, man. It's bothering me. It lives on in my heart. If this is fine progress, we're nearly home free. Wait, what could those be? The torches. Let me put those torches back where they belong. This darkness could be perilous for the next person to pass through. Nice, man. I beg your pardon for the delay. I have lit and returned the torches. My safety concerns have been addressed. Ready for departure. If you follow the track, track marked by torches, you'll reach the terminus of the cave. Okay. Is this where the uh, crowbat is? It's gone. I think that's where it was. What is that? That's different. I'm okay. I made it to the exit so fast. Um, pretty much every oh whoa, pretty much every turn in here uh, will get you where you need to go. Eventually. Yeah, that's where the crowbat was. Just want to see what's over here. Ooh! Ooh! ooh. Guys, that be a gibble. Oh my god, Hippowdon. I might not need you anymore. No! 
Oh! We have to battle it. Ooh. Battle it. No, you're not battling that. Oh my lord. Oh my god, I cannot believe the ball missed him, dude. Level 21 Gibble. Let's just try a Pokeball first. Now the question is, do I really want to run two dragons on my team? Ooh, this is not gonna work. Let's try something else. Dragon Claw doesn't affect, buddy. It's only level 21, I'm kinda scared to hit it too. Come on, baby, come on, come on. It's a great ball. All right, guys. Man, I'm so glad I decided to travel. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, it's just, it's at a dead end. It hangs out at a dead end. Man, you know, I never used Gibble on my last playthrough. Like, I feel like that would be a good Pokemon to have on this game. Like, I think I have to say goodbye to Hippowdon, guys. Don't get me wrong, I love my Hippowdon, but... Now the, the big question, do I run two dragons on my team? A dragon steel and a dragon ground. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. I could actually cross over here if I wanted to. Man, these caves are loaded with uh, things as expected. Another Zubat. Oh, another Gibbo! I hate that. I hate, I hate it. I haven't learned how to throw this thing, man. Nice. Nice, nice. Throw that at its feet. Oh. I, I threw it lower, so when it's that close, you gotta throw it much lower. What? Okay, I, I kind of understand it. When you're sitting on the ground, you gotta lay aim a little, uh... Nice. If we find an Adamant or a Jolly Gibble, I'll run it. What is that? I saw something. Like ice or something. I guess it's like a little bug or something. So cool, we found two Gibbles in this cave, guys. Amazing. Smoobat. We actually hadn't caught that many Zubats, truth be told. So it's better for flying Pokemon, supposedly. Oh. What? I wonder how much I'm missing it by. I don't know, man. Aim at its feet. No way that missed. I don't want to hear it, dude. He's gonna see me. He's gonna see me. He's gonna see me. He's gonna see me. Go away. Go eat the berry. Oh my lord. Oh no! Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay, 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 okay. It's heavy ball it.
No heavy ball. Screw it. He wasn't turned around. If he was turned around out of heavy ball, though. Nice. Okay. I know it's dangerous to run two dragons in the team, but I think I may do it. Let's see what else is in here, man. Oh! What are you doing in here? <laughs> Barboach, wow. That better not work. You know what? Just battle the stupid thing. Let's do it. Let's do it. Barboach, you think you can handle me? Let's do a water pulse. Oh, wow. That's a good hit. That was a good hit. That was perfect damage, man. I think that was a new discovery, too. Yeah, number call, 101. Whoa! Whoa! That's a whisk cash. And there's the alpha. Dang it. They gave up. Man, look at the food, bro. Oh, he's attacking. The go back came back to another one. Go eat your food. You know what, man? I give up on this, dude. I don't even think I have a, a move to defeat you. I don't think I have a... Whoa! Ooh, yeah! I don't even think I have a, a grass move to battle you. We're just gonna have to battle and see how it goes. Okay, I say we go for a... Water pose, passive spray. I say we go for a dragon pose here. I'm not really too concerned with defeating it. Oh wow, this thing is super beefy, man. Holy crap. Let's do another dragon pulse. It should survive. We should, if we get a bad roll on RNG, perfect. What? He did a full rest? <laughs> oh, you scrub. Do another uh, dragon pulse here. Nice. Another rest? Oh my lord. Stop resting, man. Too drowsy to move. Thank you. Get in the Pokeball, please. I may as well get that uh, orb over there. I'm already here. You know what would be a cool type to find in here? Aaron. Steel Dark. Now, oh. 
<laughs> that smoke bomb ain't doing it, boys. Come on, get over there, buddy. I actually don't need... What level is this thing again? Man, it is not interested. Let me heal my, uh, my Slagoo before we get destroyed. I love this cave already. Oh! It's funny that I don't actually need an item to... Man, how, how dare you turn around and face me? That had to be like the most disrespect. Look at how it eats. Okay, okay, we're fine, we're fine. We got the leading ball off? I think I can get this if I'm consistent. Nice, man! Let's go! Alpha, Alpha Crobat. Oh, this was that area where I was at, like, what do I do from here? Cool, man. Let's go ahead and get out of the cave now. So this is this whole cave itself is just like an instance. You can come in here. I found two gibbles. Pretty exciting. A crowbat, some golbats, some zubats. Professor Laventon told me how you fell to this land from the sea, the sky. For my part, I simply found myself one day here in Hisui, a region whose name I'd never heard. All I could remember was my own name. I was still standing there in bafflement when the Pearl Clan came to my aid. I showed a natural affinity for taming Pokemon, which is why I eventually became a warden. But still I wonder what my true purpose is here. I would be just as confused as you, dude. But now I've sidetracked us with this talk. Let's hurry onward. Ah, okay. That is a massive gold bat. Um, got some gold ducks. They got <laughs> gold everything. Gold everything. Gold ducks. Gold bats. Oh, my control DC'd. Oh, my controller! Alright. I gotta get that looked into, man. My, uh... Ooh. My, um... my right analog the one that one my right hand stick the little red controller because i have the regular red and blue that one keeps disconnecting on me make sure i'm not missing anything cool over here side of gold what is that oh Parasex, oh my god, go away. Little Paris's man, get out of here. All right, so what's going on? What's the big idea? Putting back all the torches. I spent ages tidying away. Do you got? Do you get some sort of amusement stopping around and ruining people's noble deeds? Oh, rendering a cave impassable to people who venture inside hardly seems noble to me. Hmm. Well, this just goes to show that even we wardens don't always see eye to eye. 
I extinguished those lights for the sake of the Pokemon in that cave who prefer the dark. But now, you louts have put the efforts to waste. If you think I'll just let you saunter ahead to meet Lord Electrode, you're sorely mistaken. The only way you're getting past me is if you defeat my partner Pokemon. How will you proceed? I'll beat him. Go, Skuntank. Show these louts the true meaning of silent but deadly. Oh my god, because it farts. This is, oh, that was a meme. That was a meme in itself, dude. Okay, so Skuntank, Night Slash. Okay, woo! Okay. What do we do here? Dark moves are not very really good on Ozai. Let's get Barnaby in. I think High Horse Power is really going to do the damage we need. Them getting that first turn on me was brutal. Flamethrower. Ooh, that was a good switch. Oh my god, this thing hits crazy hard. What is going on? They were not kidding. Well, actually, they are kidding. This thing's supposed to be a tank. Wow, that was a fast. Whew. My poor baby almost got murdered there. Listen here, neither I nor Skuntank admit defeat just yet. Our challenge to you still stands. However, I will withdraw to afford Skuntank time to recover. There's no shame in a tactic or a treat. It's more of an advance if you think about it. Keep your guard up. We'll be back. What a lively character. Absolutely. That is an Avery to the core, guys. I can't fathom... Warden Melly's intentions, but for now, let us press on. That must be Avery's Warden from Sword and Shield. Oh. I didn't think of that at all. Well, now we know. That flamethrower, for something we resist, it really murdered me, dude. But you know what, guys? I say we leave this for the next episode. We've got a good bit of stuff in here to, to uh, explore, and I do see some Pokemon in there. I think I see Ghastlies. Not sure. No, those are Bronzongs. Nice. Um, but yeah, guys, we're going to continue this next time. Thanks for watching. Hopefully I'll catch you all later. And until then, see ya.